Hi, Miss Holly's class. I'm happy to see you again today. I hope you've been having a good week. We're going to start with our hug. Everybody give it to me. I want to feel it. Oh, good job. Okay, I have a little surprise today. The, usually, just the four-year-old teachers do this, like Miss Nicole and Miss Melanie and Miss Sarah. But uh, Miss Teresa thought it would be okay if Miss Holly's class did it. So I ordered some of these. And you could order these if you wanted to. If you wanted to get some, you could tell um, your mom and dad, and I can tell them where I got these from. But this is caterpillars. Can you see them in there? And we're going to watch these caterpillars. They're going to change and be butterflies. Isn't that exciting? It just came just like this. And this stuff in the bottom, that's their food. That's all they need to eat right now. And then as they get bigger, we'll put them in a net, like a butterfly net, and Miss Holly will feed them a little bit. Oh my goodness, look, they're moving around. Can you see that? So I'm so excited to show you how this works. How they start like this, and how they'll go in the top, and then they'll wrap themselves up, and then they'll bust out for a butterfly. So Miss Holly just got these in the mail, so I wanted to show you that. Okay. All right. Well, okay, we're going to start with our pledge. So everybody stand up. I hope you're still doing this. Okay, hand on heart. Ready? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Great job. All right, we're going to talk about our calendar. Let me get my little pointer out. Okay, we talked about this on Monday, so I know you remember. What month are we on? April. And it starts with the letter A. That's right. So, everybody say today is... Wednesday. So it's Wednesday, April, and what is our number? We are on number 15. So let's count to 15. Are we ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15. Good job. We are right in the middle of the calendar. Right in the middle. Getting close to the end. All right. So, today what I thought we would do, we're going to be talking about numbers because we've learned, y'all have worked so hard and learned all of your numbers 1 through 10. So, you should have these cards that Miss Holly had asked, had sent to you, and I asked you to color each one. Well, Miss Holly's gonna lay her cards out, so that's what I would like for you to do. If you have your, if you have your cards, just lay them out like this in front of you. Okay, just like that. All right. Now, if you don't have your cards. You don't have them colored, then you can just do the game with Miss Holly online. You can just use my cards. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna call out. I think I'm gonna call out first. This first one is I'm gonna call out a number, and I want you to tell me what color that number is. And when we get it right, I'm gonna turn it over. Okay. So where is the number? Two. Does anybody find the number two? Can you point to it on your screen for Miss Holly? And what color is it? That's right. If you picked this one, it's blue. So I'm going to turn it over. All right. Where is the number five? Point to it. And what color is it? Pink. Okay. Now I'm going to switch it up. Which one is the color purple? Can you tell which one is purple? Let's point to it. Did you get it right? And what number is this? 
the number seven. Where is the color brown? Can you tell which one is brown? Point to it. What number is this? Nine. All right, can anyone find the number one? Yes, what color is it? Red. How about the number four? What color? Green. Where is the number three? Yellow. Does anybody know where zero is? Point to it. And this one is gray. How about which one? Let's change it again. Which one is black? Which color is black? Point to it. That's right, and that is the number six. And our last one, can anyone say what our last number is? What number is it? It's the number eight, and it's orange. Good job, Miss Holly's class. And I'm going to turn them over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then our zero. Good job. Okay. Now, our next thing is you're going to need, um, I sent a copy. You're going to need your scissors. So, if you don't have your scissors, I want you to go and get them. Okay. Miss Holly has her scissors. Okay. We have two papers. One has a bunch of circles that go down and up like this. And then you should have a piece of paper that has circles on them and it has numbers, numbers one through ten. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to cut these out. So, you're going to get your scissors. What Miss Holly's going to do is I'm going to cut these in sections first. So, if you want to do like me, you can. Now, this might take a little while. So, you might want to pause the video and cut out all your numbers and have them all ready, and then you can push play on your video. So you're just gonna cut them all out. Miss Holly's gonna go fairly fast. So like I said, I want you to take your time. Um, so just hit pause for a second and get them all cut out and then come back to Miss Holly. How do y'all think I'm doing? Just turn in my paper. Okay, there's some of them. I know I have a lot of good cutters in Miss Holly's class. Well, actually, you're all good cutters. So we're just trying to make, what shape are we making when we're cutting these out? Can you tell? Yeah, we're making a circle. We're making a bunch of circles. Okay. Have a few more. Okay, two more. And just try your best. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put these in order. So you're going to need to know your numbers. Okay. So I have all my numbers. And I'm going to lay these out where I can see them. Okay. You have them all laid out. Okay. Now, Miss Holly's going to take her glue stick. And we have how many circles? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's perfect because I have ten numbers. So we're going to start at the top. Which one is first? Yes, the number one. 
So we're gonna put it right there. And then what comes after one? Find your number, two. And then what's after two? Three. Then we have the number four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And what's our last number? That's right, the number 10. Did everybody get your numbers glued on? That was a lot of work. That was a lot of cutting and a lot of gluing. You could just leave it like this or you can give it legs and it could be a caterpillar. Let's see, I think I'll get a marker. The number one is gonna be my caterpillar's head. So then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna draw some legs on here. Look how silly. Uh-oh. Now we have this a caterpillar. Caterpillar. And if you don't want to make a caterpillar, you don't have to. You could just have your numbers. You could show your mom and dad what a great job you did. And then on the number one, we could just do some little eyes and a little mouth. Isn't that cute? Miss Holly's so proud of you. Good job, Miss Holly's class. I know that was a lot of work, but you're such good workers. All right. Well, since we're doing numbers today, I'm gonna read a story. It's a little bit of a long story. I think you'll like it. Chicka Chicka, one, two, three. <clears throat> Have you ever read this story before? One toad two and two toad three, I'll race you to the top of the apple tree. Climb, said four to five and six, Bright little numbers that join the mix. Hooray, yelled seven to number eight. Slow Pope fella, who's always late. Chicka, chicka, one, two, three. Will there be a place for me? The number zero's looking for a place. Here comes nine to the apple tree. Next comes 10 and then 11. Wow, these apples taste like heaven. Chicka, chicka, one, two, three. Where there be Will there be a place for me? Hot pink 12, lucky 13, picking apples, red and green. 14, 15, can't you see? They all want to climb the apple tree. Chicka, chicka, one, two, three. Will there be a place for me? He's still looking. 16's next to make the scene, climbing branches with 17, 18, 19, one more's 20, Numbers, numbers, there are plenty. Chicka, chicka, one, two, three. Will there be a place for me? This zero is worried. Curvy 30, flat foot 40, climbing up to join the party. 50's fine and 60's dandy. 70's hair is long and sandy. Chicka, chicka, one, two, three. Will there be a place for me? Let's climb more, says treetop 80, higher, higher, up to 90, until at last there's 99. All the numbers are feeling fine, except for zero, who begins to cry, chicka, chicka, one, two, three, where there'll be a place for me? He is so sad. Oh, no, buzzing, close, bumblebees. Zero hides behind the tree. Can you see him hiding? Get out of here, get out of our tree, the bumblebee shouts, and all the numbers go tumbling out. 90, 80, 70 fall, hit the ground, 
in a free-for-all. 60, 50, 40, run. No more climbing, no more fun. 30 next, then sweet little 20. Numbers, numbers, no long plenty. 19, 18, my oh my. Frightened numbers jump and fly. 17, 16, 15 more. Now 14 has hit the floor. And 13 too, the unlucky guy. 12 had almost touched the sky. Beat up, bit up 11. Wait, where's 10? 9, 8, 7, follow then. Twisted 6 and top hat 5. 4, 3, 2, 1, they take a dive. Chicka, chicka, 1, 2, 3. Now I know the place for me. He's figured it out. Zero leaps into the sky. Brave little number, he's not shy. Zero lands on top of the tree, joins with ten. Now a hundred, you see. Chicka, chicka, one, two, one, two, three. Here's the place that's just for me. All the numbers come back out higher and higher as they all shout. Chicka, chicka, one, two, three. Zero's the hero of the number tree. The end. That's a lot of numbers. Did y'all enjoy that story? That's a fun one. Okay, Miss Holly's class, that's it for today, and I will see you Friday on Zoom. I hope to get to see you, and I'll show you um, on Friday the caterpillars, and we'll see if they've made any changes. I love you. Bye-bye.